It's time to get crazy with creative again. Last week I had so much fun experimenting with cars and doing all sorts of crazy stuff. Well this week we're gonna do the same thing but with a chopper. There is some cool news with cars and I'm gonna go over that real quick and then I'm gonna take last week's experiments but take it to the next level. And then finally I'm gonna build my patented copter cannon. Let's go. Okay guys, before we get too crazy, I've heard they've increased the max speed of the car. Oh yeah, look at that. It's going up to, oh my gosh, how fast can we get this going if we just go straight? Whoa, top speed, 119, 120, how fast? Okay, if 120 seems like the top speed. Whoa, that kind of changes things with the whiplash. That actually feels quite a bit faster. But why stop at 120, Epic? Why stop at 120? Let's make it 220. Before we move on to messing around with helicopters, I saw Richie Tunes messing around with the air vents and getting some crazy speeds with the cars. So you can make it so these aren't visible in game, so you can pass straight through them. And then you can make it so their knockup force is like mega high. So then we can just copy a bunch of these. And then I want to see what happens when I launch off that rock out there. All right, let's just do this guys here we go Whoa! <laughs> I hit that at a really bad angle, but I want to do this right. I think my angle is just a bit steep. All right, let's try again. All right, I gotta be careful not to like hit anything. Here we go. Whoa! <laughs> we cleared the whole island. Amazing. That's amazing, guys. All right, now that we're completely stuck at 490 miles an hour, let's move on to the helicopters. So last week with the cars, I had them all bouncing in here, and it was kind of fun and crazy. But this week, we're gonna take it to the next level. I wanna throw in cars, I wanna throw in copters, and I wanna throw in all the airplanes we can put. Basically, what I wanna do, guys, is throw every vehicle in the game in this little space. So I need to figure out how many I can actually do first. So because you can only have 16 cars and four copters, I wanted to see how many just vehicles I could put down, so I started putting down as many planes as I could, and then uh, this happened. Oh no, guys, my game's frozen. I already broke creative and I just started. But after I loaded back in and got all my tests done, I learned that you could only have 32 total vehicles. All right, there's our max vehicles that we can have, guys. Now we gotta fit them all in here. Actually, now that I think about it, maybe we should make a crash pad little, like, I don't know, bounce room. So I got to work making my crash pad bounce house. This only took a few minutes to make, but as I was starting to put in the vehicles and letting them drop, I ran into my first problem. Goodbye, semis! <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh! Ah! Whoa! Holy cow, guys, look how fast they're bouncing around! That's insane! Okay, but they're getting flung out of this thing. So the logical thing I thought of was to make it bigger and put a roof on the thing. That would work, right? Okay, look, they're bouncing around quite a bit. Wait, they're disappearing and not respawning. Oh, they're getting through the walls! Ugh. So why not put some indestructible walls around that they can't get through? That would fix it, right? Okay, it's bouncing around. It just got out. What the heck? It blasted through the indestructible wall. Okay, then. How about this? We put some damage barriers around the exterior of the bounce house. That will destroy the car and respawn it in the bounce house. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I think I got this all set up. Let's see if it works. All right, here we go. Moment of truth, guys. Let's see if this works. Oh my gosh! The game hasn't even started yet! Look at that! Oh my goodness! What is happening? I'm gonna go join in it. Ah! <laughs> ah! I can't wait to look at this in replay mode and like go in slow motion. Gosh, see, like if I sit down in the middle of it, <laughs> I should probably get, make myself invulnerable. Ah! <laughs> I want to see my. Can I get in a car? Like I did. Okay, I want to try and get in a vehicle. Oh! Can't. I'm just like spamming. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> you can't. It's impossible. It's moving too fast. Like, look at that. Like, I don't even see. Oh, cars must be getting out because it's like the the numbers are dwindling. Oh, it's okay, guys. I feel like I got what I wanted out of this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, one more time. I want to see if I can catch that plane. Give me that plane. Oh, I got in the plane. I'm in the plane. Ah! <laughs> okay, for my next thing, I want to see if I can build a copter cannon. So basically, I want a helicopter to like spawn right in front of this and then have it launch. Let's just see if I can get this to work even a little bit. So if I put the helicopter down here, what happens? Whoa, I have no idea where the helicopter went. Okay, well, that kind of works. <laughs> Oh, look, there it is. Okay, it got launched. Now we just gotta direct this a little bit. I've kind of set up a little system here where I push the button and it's gonna launch it. Basically, I have it so 
it enables this bumper when I push this button. I just kind of wanted like a button for my cannon. Okay, here we go. We're gonna interact with this and see what happens. Whoa, there it goes. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh, and it's respawning! Holy cow! This totally launches thing! But it's like completely random where it goes! I don't know how I'm going to control this insane device. Okay, so I figured out that if you put the bumper beneath the spawn pad, you could get a straight shot every time. So I wanted to see if this would work at an angle, and it totally worked! The only thing I had to do was build a little box so that it could hold the helicopter and wait till I pushed a button. Then I just built a little cannon that went around all of it, put some explosives at the end so that it looked like like a firing cannon and it was time to test it out. All right, here we go. The moment of true fire cannon. Boom. Oh, oh, I didn't. Oh, wait, there it goes. Oh, I can't even see it. That's hilarious. Like, you can just kind of see it for a second. Look, you'll watch right up in the sky. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> ah, it works. I'll have to see it in slow motion though with the actual explosion. I'm going to make this really slow because I want to see if this actually works. Okay, so there's our uh, copter set up. All right, I want to see if this actually like comes out as it explodes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to see that again. That was at 0.1 speed, guys. That was so slow. Okay, let's see here. Oh my gosh, that is so awesome. Oh, there it goes. It totally disappears. There it goes. <laughs> guys, there it goes. Ah, I can't even keep up with it. It just disappears. <laughs> oh man, creative mode is so fun, guys.